This is the story of Pola Negri, a Polish stage and film actress who was the first European film star to be invited to Hollywood. She achieved worldwide fame and became a great movie star and sex symbol in the golden era of Hollywood silent film. The musical is performed in a show hall that seats over 2,000. The actors move about a stage with a surface area of 200 square meters. The set design, prepared in stereoscopic technology, is projected behind them, making the stage appear very spatial. The actors become an integral part of the virtual world. Platij Image prepared the entire virtual 3D scenography for the musical, directed by Janusz Józefowicz. There were two reasons why I decided to use uh, 3D technology while staging Polita. First of all, no one uh, ever has done it before, so um, combining um, stereoscopy and traditional theatre elements was uh, extremely exciting. And secondly, uh, the virtual world has no weight, so we didn't have to worry about tons of scenography, which was uh, always a problem of a big um, productions. Uh, with 3D technology, nothing is impossible. So I think Polita uh, brings a musical theater uh, into the 21st century. The latest computer animation techniques and stereoscopic technology were used, achieving an innovative connection between the theater and film worlds. The first step was to create simplified animations of each virtual set and test them to stereoscopic scale. Then the animation was perfected. Actors, shot earlier on green screen with a stereoscopic camera, were added to some scenes. The last stage was to add 3D generated objects, such as birds. Each set needed to be created from scratch. Some of them were relatively easy, being static backgrounds to complement the actors. The most interesting and most difficult were the animations that had to interact with the actors. They were created to fit perfectly into the real set and to flow seamlessly with the movement on stage. The scale of the venture was huge. A 22-meter stage and 100 actors who all together needed to leave the audience mesmerized. When working on the virtual sets, the Platige team made precise calculations in what proportion and how deep to place the actors, buildings, and virtual sets so their scale fit what was happening on stage. There were many trial screenings in the Platige Image Cinema, even though the screen is only one-fifth the size. The team tested everything until they were sure the virtual world would work in concert with the actors and the elements of the real sets. After eight months of work, it was possible to test the animation on the full-sized stage.